snake shedding. What is it? Hmm. Reptile fans, what's good? It's your boy Rock from Rock Reptiles. And yes, we are back with a video. And today's topic is the shedding process. What is it? What what can I expect if this is my first snake that I'm getting into? What can I expect during the shedding process? So I'm going to inform you about that right now. So snakes, what is shedding? Shedding is them getting rid of their old skin and going into their new skin. You know, they're growing. They're, con they're continuously growing. They grow for their entire lifetime. When they're younger, like Queen Akasha is right here, they will grow um, more rapidly. So you could expect her to shed more than she will shed in, let's say, five to six years from now. You know, it'll drastically drop as the amounts of shed, you know, so you can always know that. But what is shed? They're getting rid of their old skin because it no longer fits. They're getting too large for their old skin, so they got to get rid of it just like we shed our skin. We don't see it or shed it in one piece like them, but hey, it is what it is. So the first thing that you will notice, your snake's colors will dull out. Once they dull out, you will start to notice a milkyish, creamyish, white, water, watered down, whitish color under their like in their skin. You will notice it on their belly. You will notice it in their eyes. That's called being opaque or going into blue, whichever one you prefer. That is the first signs well that's the first step to your snake going to shed basically what going opaque is it's a fluid that comes between their old skin layer and their new skin layer as their new skin layer officially and finally matures enough to where they can now shed their old skin layer off so once they go opaque you're going to go in your cage one day you know if you, you know of course when they're going through shed you check on to make sure everything is good and you will notice that the eyes cleared up. You'll see some of the colors back, but not all of the color. But you'll see some of the color back, and you might not see shedding. You might think, hey, did my snake eat the shed? Did the shed get mixed up in the substrate? No, it did not. That means they have went out of blue, and within four to seven days, then they will officially shed off their old skin and shed into their new skin. And if you got your husbandry, your temperatures and humidity on point, they will shed in one piece, just like this beautiful girl did the other day, shed in one beautiful piece in her branches. That's where she went. She went up and shed it up in the branches. So, hey, man, things that you need to do as far as shed, increase whatever snake you have, you need to increase the humidity. Whatever your humidity range is for your snake, Make sure you increase it. I'm not saying dr 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 drastically. I could not figure out the word to save my life. Man, but don't drastically like go crazy with increasing. Like if you have a snake that average humidity should be 40 to 50%. Hey, hit it about a good 60%. You know, try to get it up in there and that 60 to 65% humidity during the shedding times like with her i usually keep her because she's a animal from a more tropical climate and usually is in higher humidity all the time i usually keep her standard humidity 65 to 75 percent during shed i take it up you know 80 percent eight you know 85 percent humidity during her shed cycle if you have a glass aquarium and you and you find it difficult to keep your you know you're able to keep your recommended humidity, but you find it higher to boost up your humidity. Another thing you can do is make a humid hide. All the humid hide is, is you can get, depending on the size of the snake, get something, a little box or something that they can go into, cut a hole on top of it. Make sure you sand down the edges so they won't hurt themselves. But where they could go into and the humidity high, is high in there so that they could you know hydrate their skin so they can have a beautiful and successful shed man that is important if your shed is breaking up into pieces that means something is off in your husband husbandry 
That means you need to increase that humidity. Your temperatures might be a little off. There's something that you need to do. So if it's breaking up to shed, man, keep doing more research. And, you know, a lot of things are trial and error. You know, we think that we got everything on point. Then we find out that we have it off a little bit. And that happens to everybody. Definitely when you first get into snakes, man. You know, it's somewhat it's trial and error. You have to find out what works for you as far as keeping the temperatures right, keeping the humidity right. And making sure your snake is just living the best possible life that it could possibly have, man. So that was shed in a nutshell. I know it's a little quick video, but that's what the shedding process is. They go they go through a stage called being opaque or going into blue that lasts about four to seven days. Then they clear up and about four to seven days later, you should have a fully beautiful new fresh skin snake and you will see the old skin laying right there in the cage and if like i say you got everything on point it should be one long piece of shed one long beautiful piece of shed so hey man y'all know hey, i went through my first shed with her everything was on point she's eating like a champ everything that she does is like a champ you can see she is very curious and but i love this girl man but hey man I'm going to be dropping videos, different videos, not just feeding videos all the time. So, man, just subscribe, like, comment, share, turn on your post bill notifications, and tell your family and friends about it. Tell everybody. I mean, just tell them to come to Rock to Reptiles and hit that subscribe button. Just click it. That's all you really got to do. Just bing, post bill, you know. But, hey, man, let's keep growing. Let's keep going. Appreciate all the love and the support, man. And I'm out of here, so. Take care of yourself and your loved ones and enjoy your week and weekend.